Hello guys, this is Ty, aka The Flip Man. This video is how I did my first deal within the first 30 days. If you haven't seen my videos um, here on YouTube, um, I'm not sure uh, what you've been looking for. They're over 100. Uh, tell you everything you need to know. Those are free. You need a coach and a step-by-step -st -step course on wholesaling houses and wholesaling apartments. You can go over to the website junkers101.com to sign up there. Some great options. No one online can beat them. I, I feel safe in saying that in, as far as what I offer and being able to speak directly with me. Someone's been doing this for 11 plus years, still doing it. So uh, it's an opportunity for you as a beginner or an ongoing wholesaler real estate investor to get into business and work with an experienced ongoing investor for basically pennies compared to what else is out there and what's being offered i don't have to tell you a lot of you've already experienced it so there's no time to wait get it now but on with my first deal my first deal um first of all which I've told his story, but that, that actual audio was uh, removed from my website. So it was out there for, a lot of you have heard this, but a lot haven't. Probably more haven't heard uh, how I got started and, you know, why I even got interested in real estate in the beginning. So I'm going to try to make this direct and short, but hopefully this will let you know how, wh what I felt when I started. And, and a lot of you have experienced the same things. First of all, I'm an entrepreneur first. So real estate is just a way I have made actual money. Um, but how I got interested, a, a friend of mine and his now wife uh, were taking a real estate investment course. And the instructor that normally taught the class wasn't there. So the substitute that talked to class a particular night, he didn't talk about being a realtor, which a lot of you think being a realtor and investing are the same thing. They're related because it's real estate, but they can be totally, totally different things and not even related to each other at the same time. Uh, it'll just depend on the record, realtor, what level, broker, what type of clients they deal with, so on. But this guy, he talked to them about investing in real estate. So my friend came back and told me some of the things that he heard, uh, and I was blown away because it didn't seem real because he talked about no money uh, investing in real estate, no money down techniques. And so uh, that was like, I'm going by memory here, but I'm pretty sure that was like in October of 2002. So I didn't act on it at that time. So fast forward to December of 2002, and I was at home at my at my mom's uh, house for Christmas, and it was up early that morning. I was just watching TV, and I um, noticed uh, one of Carlton Sheets, which I don't even know if they come on TV anymore, but Carlton Sheets program on. Uh, no money down real estate. And so if, if you've seen it like I have, you've noticed that uh, it's not really telling you anything, but just a lot of people saying, hey, I made this much money, I made that much money, blah, 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 but not really telling you anything. So I caught it about halfway through the program, and uh, I said, well, let me find mm -hmm. it on, an, on another channel. So I watched it all the way through, the same thing. You know, it's really not telling you anything, but it did inspire me to go ahead and do some research on it along with what my friend had told me about that particular class. So when I got back home, I did a, a search. I, well, I posted a message on this uh, message board that I used to used to frequent. Uh, it was a uh, entrepreneur message board. It actually, I think it was ablake.net, very old message board. I don't mean, even wonder what it's like right now. Uh, it's probably still alive. But anyway, I posted a message, does Carlton Sheets program really work? And only one person replied, yes, it does, but Ron Legrand's course works better. And so I did a search for Ron Legrand, 
and I found his course. And at that time, he was charging $1,500 for his package. And so uh, a lot of money uh, at that time, and there's no way I could have justified that. So um, what I did do is uh, on that website, they had a, uh, a, a condensed version of the course, which really was a teaser in cassette tape form for $69.95 with shipping. It was just around $80. So I ordered that, received that, and all it did was wet my beak to let me know that this is something that I need to pursue. So I made up my mind if I had to get an extra job to save the money I was. So a few days later, I thought about eBay. And I did a search for Ron Legrand, and I see saw that his course was available uh, on an auction. Well, several auctions. So I bid it on one of the auctions and lost. And at that time, I think you can get away with this now with eBay. But the guy that was running the auction, I didn't win it. So, But he... I guess this is, this is the way he was generating money from it. Uh, he asked, would I be interested in uh, buying a, uh, a burnt copy of the course, which is basically a bootleg version of the course. So uh, we agreed, we finally agreed on $400. So at the time, I, I, I just took something for something else and, and paid it. So he shipped me the course. He sent me a course on wholesaling retailing, uh, subject to, uh, owner finance, lease options, um, a lot of information. It took me about three weeks to go through it all. And I was really more confused than anything because it was so much information. It was, and it was really detailed, but I still had a lot of questions. One thing they said in the course was, uh, Ron said that you'll go ask one of your realtor friends or someone that you know the realtor about this and what they're going to tell you is you can't do this this is illegal blah 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 and I did exactly what he said uh, I shouldn't do and that's the response I got so that even confirmed for me that he knew what he was talking about so but anyway out of all of that that I got one thing that I did get is to put out bandit signs to get that phone ringing uh, this business can be so frustrating without your phone ring if you're just looking for deals because you have to go through so many calls to get to a deal on average. You, your first call may be a deal because that's basically what happened to me. But after I put out signs, I basically paid $250 for 50 signs, paid way overpaid. You know, you can get for $250 now, you should be able to get. Um, 150 to 200 signs easily, whereas I paid 250 for 50 signs. So I put those out on a Sunday, and my phone started ringing that Monday. I had failed at so many things, other things as far as an entrepreneur that um, <laughs> I felt I was a success at that point. So, but anyway, the first two calls I got, one was uh, a lease option opportunity where um, I ended up getting 5000 down for a lease option. Probably didn't know what I was doing, but ended up having to give that money back to the later lady, to the, the lady that gave me the money because the owner and I almost came to ask, actual fisticuffs. Uh, and he was a preacher. <laughs> Long story, can't get into that. But anyway, the other, uh, the other deal was uh, two sisters that inherited a property that they had been running out for the last four or five years and they were tired of being a landlord because the thought was this was mom how we grew up in this house we're not going to sell it but after going through allowing a couple of relatives to rent it they tearing it up fixing it renting it again tearing it up fixing it tired of paying taxes they called me and um when they called me i went to one of them's house to uh, do the initial contract and so when i showed up you know, they actually thought I had the money with me. And I had to explain to them that it doesn't work like that. And so, uh, long story short on that, back then the newspaper was a great way to advertise your properties. Now it's Craigslist and a lot of the free cl classified sites. But place an ad in the newspaper, a realtor called me, and actually I had an, an investor-minded realtor that had a friend that wanted the property. I got it at 20000 they were going to buy it at twenty five thousand, but the realtor said the only way he'll bring his buyer to the table, I had to split my 
five thousand with him, which was fine. You know, twenty five hundred dollars was a good payday. So uh, we agreed on uh, the five thousand with me paying the real estate, uh, the, the realtor twenty five hundred dollars of that money. So I ended up with twenty five hundred. So when we closed on it, um, I received my twenty five hundred. The seller received that twenty thousand. Bam, that was my first deal. I put my first set of signs out the first week of February and closed my first deal March 5th, 2003. Now, that's not how it may work for everyone. Uh, one thing about me, and it gets me in trouble sometimes, I hear something, and if I can do it, my resource would allow me to do it, I'm going to think about it till my brain stops working, and I'm going to put it into action. A lot of people analytical I've been researching real estate five years I've never researched anything that long <laughs> five days is a long time for me I can't when people say five years on research I'm not I can't wrap my mind around it what are you waiting on I know you're afraid to make mistakes you're gonna make mistakes that's the great thing about wholesaling it will allow you to make mistakes and not lose your shirt that's because it doesn't matter if you have one dollar in the bank or a million dollars in the bank a 450 credit score or 850 credit score, it won't matter. That's the great thing about learning how to wholesale real estate, houses, apartments, whatever. That's the great thing about it. Get off the couch. If you don't have the money, get a second job. You know, if you're going to deal with me, regardless if you're going to deal with me or not, but because I give the information away, obviously, but if you want me to be a coach in the Get out and get a second job and raise the money. Or if you're already doing it and you don't have enough money to, to put a, a marketing plan in because it will cost a few hundred dollars to do that, get out and get a second job and do it. To raise the extra money to do it. But anyway, that's my soapbox. So that's how my first deal went down. I just said this, this story has been told to many of you over and over again. I used to have it on my actual website, but whenever the website was redesigned, those audios went away. So uh, hopefully this video helps. Uh, you know you can get the course and coaching at junkers101.com. You can call me or text me, 205-492-3425. Also take advantage of the 100 plus videos at my YouTube channel, Teach Me Flipping. Just do a search on YouTube for Teach Me Flipping, all one word. Thanks, and have a great day.